Hi guys, this is Julia from Team Fluorescent Flying Penguins, and today I'm going to be talking about the compare block. The compare block is a block that compares two numbers and asks whether they are equal to, if they're equal to, if they're not equal to, if they're greater, if one is greater than the other, greater than or equal to, less than, and less than, or less than or equal to. It then outputs a true false input, which output, which can be put inputted into a switch like I have done here. If the answer is true, the EV3 will say yes. If the answer is false, the EV3 will say no. I'm going to ask you questions and it's going to answer. Here we go. EV3, I have a question. Is 4 equal to 5? No. Okay. Thank you for that information. Is 4 not equal to 5 then? Yes. Okay. Is 4 greater than 5? Is 4 greater than or equal to 5? No. Is 4 less than 5 then? Yes. Is 4 less than or equal to 5? Yes. Okay. So something else that you all might be wondering is how EV3 handles decimals. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make these both decimals. So I'm going to do point nine nine. I'm going to do 0.999, and this one's going to be 0.998. So this might help us figure out how, how far back in the decimals they go. So I'm going to say greater than. This should be, so the answer to this should be yes. EV3, is 0.999 greater than 0.998? Okay, so apparently when doing compare blocks, it goes to at least the third digit. Thank you for watching this EV3 tutorial with Team Fluorescent Flying Penguins. Thank you and goodbye.